friends and welcome back to my channel and if you are new here welcome today's video is a christmas decorate with me for 2020 now it did take me a lot longer to decorate for christmas just because i do have a newborn and a toddler so i was taking a lot of breaks in between just to make sure that they were fed and well attended but nonetheless i did have a lot of fun creating this video for you guys and just decorating with Riley. We recently upgraded our Christmas tree. This one is from Walmart. It was $39 and it is a six and a half foot pre-lit tree and I'm just in love with it. This ornament was really hard and unbreakable. Yeah. Not so much, you guys. tip on how to fluff your Christmas tree thanks to my friend Jacqueline you definitely want to make sure that your branches are being fluffed up and down and not just to the side or else your tree is going to look sparse instead of full so make sure that you're fluffing them for the top and bottom of the tree I'm going to be quite frank with you guys. I hated how my Christmas tree turned out the first time I decorated it. I sat down after I was done and I just kept looking at it and felt that it just looked awful and definitely not what I had envisioned that I wanted my Christmas tree to look like. So I decided to contact two of my very good friends here on YouTube, Carla from Carla's Sweet Life and Jackie from Jacqueline Lopez. You guys should check out their channel. They have amazing content right now in regards to Christmas and Christmas decorate and a lot of DIY. So I will leave their channel linked down below. But they helped me execute what I had envisioned that I wanted my Christmas tree to look like. And if you guys stay tuned until the end, you will see how my Christmas tree turned out. When the bell on the door jingled once more And then time almost came to a stop But somehow I knew Shout out to all of these home decor and DIY content creators here in YouTube 
don't know how you guys do it, but I had such a hard time working with the ribbon. It was my first time. I had no idea what I was doing. I actually searched up a video on YouTube on how to put ribbons. And even though it didn't come out exactly how it did in the video, I do love how it turned out on my Christmas tree. It just added fullness to it and the extra oomph that I was looking for. It's gonna be you and me decorating the tree from this Christmas sun. We forgot. about to show you guys is a game changer for your Christmas tree. It is these toilet spinners for your ornaments and how they work is you have to hook them up to your string of lights. They have to be non-LED or else it's not going to work. And you unplug the light bulb from your string of lights and plug in the toilet and it just animates and brings your ornaments to a life. It just adds an extra touch of glam to your Christmas tree. I am so glad that I got it. And I got this idea from watching the Ken Wolwins video, watch this before decorating your Christmas tree. So glad that I did. You guys will not regret it. I will leave a link down in the description bar below for you guys. Next up is the coffee bar. I wanted to keep everything here at a minimal but super festive so I decided to reorganize the coffee mugs, take any that were broken and throw them out, and put everything that doesn't belong here in their corresponding spots. Here I'm taking the hot cocoa and putting it into a mason jar. I did get both of them from Dollar Tree. I suggest you guys do the same because it is cheaper. They go for a dollar as opposed to the other one that I got from Hobby Lobby, which was at like $2.99, $3, depending on the size and variety. It's white outside. I did place the wooden spoons into the third mason jar and I did want to use the Target dollar spot sign that I had but I just felt that it made the space super cluttered so I decided to not place it there and instead I decided to place it on top of the stove along with the little mini tree that I got from Hobby Lobby. I also decided to whip out some of the dish towels that I got from the Target dollar spot from a year or two ago. With joy, yes, it's Christmas all around. All snow is falling down, all the colored lights lighting up this town. And as I walk outside, hear the Christmas choir sing, Merry Christmas. That is it for today's video. I hope that you did enjoy and got some inspiration for your Christmas tree, coffee bar, or for any space that you are decorating. Do not forget about the giveaway that I am hosting in this video. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye! With so much love And with joy and laughter